Derrick Henry at number 18. I have him at 14. The most uh, I love it. Most bullish on Derrick. Jason has him at 18. Mike at 21. Last year, uh, well, he he had a really nice week. 14 scored uh, 47.8 fantasy points. <laughs> set the world on fire. In fact, 48% of his fantasy points came in weeks 14 through 16. Now, I remember this next stat. He didn't surpass 65 total yards until that game. You want to know why I remember that, Brooks? Why is that? Because I, I said it 30 times on the show the next week when I told people not to play him. <laughs> <laughs> and then he went out and scored 29.7 points in the follow-up. In the sequel. With 33 carries. Yeah, with 33 carries, then 15, and then 11. He's a mm, if he, those trends continue, he is a uh, he is a big man. He can take a pounding, thirty plus carries. If there's anybody in the NFL, assuming Marshawn Lynch isn't in it, if there's anybody that can that can handle 25, 30 carries a game. It's Derrick Henry. They also had success. Um, and uh, my my ranking is based entirely on the belief that that success will continue into the new year. That's it. Yeah, I, it's it's so tough to buy into Derrick Henry. We have what three point eight or whatever seasons of. I was gonna say it's a little of, high for his yards per carry. No, no, no. His yards per is, carry been great. The three point eight uh, seasons of Derrick Henry, hope, hype, and then complete and total failure for <laughs> anything for fantasy purposes except the fantasy playoffs of last year. The team wants to build around him. Great. I, unlike the Colts, unlike the Patriots, sorry, Titans fans, I'm not buying into your offense, and that's why I'm hesitant, very hesitant I for Derrick Henry. I am buying into the Tennessee Derrick Henrys. I, I am fully convinced, based on looking at everything that they've both said and done, right? You can't just get on the hype train alert, oh, Vrabel wants to get him the ball, oh, the the tight you know the the tight end coach who's now their offensive coordinator says we need to get him the ball. Oh, the owner says we need to get him the ball. That's all great, but then they went out and they spent big money to improve their guard, and they're they are building their team to run the ball with Derrick Henry. And Derrick Henry, we you know his yards per carry on I, the majority of his carries are not good, but on his career they've always been great because he gets those huge breakaway runs. But he's capable of that. I mean, he spent the first two years. Behind DeMarco Murray. He was great coming out of college. Damian Williams has a long history in the NFL. He had three great games. Sure. Situations change. Damian Williams got extended. <laughs> oh <laughs> You're going God. back to the two-year five well, million. But here's the, here's the thing. That, that, I will it, give you $5 million not to mention that anymore. Accepted. Uh, you, <laughs> Dang well, that's it. a good <laughs> deal, Mike. Quick you're, on the draw. You were going to lead me into my next point. Brooks, Brooks, write him a check. Before talking Damian is... They're okay. They're going to build their team around Derrick Henry. Derrick Henry's in a contract year. I mean, if the team is so sure that Derrick Henry is the future of this team, why would you let him go into the last year of his contract and possibly maybe they lose won't? Him? It's April third. No, and, and not well, only that. Not I don't. Have you heard anything? Any whispers about contract extensions for Derrick Henry? Uh, I've heard whispers about whispers. <laughs> Here, here's the here's the truth. I mean, those they, are ghosts. They want Derrick Henry to be their feature back. They don't need to extend him. And if they give him the ball twenty times a game and he sucks, they don't they don't they won't extend him. Yeah, they're gonna try it. Yeah, but we we did say if he's if he's not good, he'll be he'll be bad. That is well said, Andy. <laughs> Unbelievable here's the insight. Thing. Mike mentioned some ghosts. There is a ghost there. Deion Lewis is still a yes, he is. member of the Titans. Um, but it seems like this team kind of figured out. They tried to force Deion Lewis uh, into – like, had they never signed him, they would have been better off last year. I agree. Yeah. If you want more of that, click down there, see the whole episode, click over there, subscribe to the show. We're here all year round. Do not miss it.